All right, so I've been playing Bedwars for over a year now. We're going to be going back to check some older videos to see how I've progressed throughout the year and how things have changed. We're obviously going to have to go ahead and check the first video that I ever did on Bedwars. All right, so this is my first ever video on Roblox Bedwars. And as you guys can see, bro, I was pulling out with a bow, all right? Before I played Bedwars, all I did was play FPS games and train my aim, all right? So why wouldn't I use it, you know what I'm saying? People were complaining about bow spamming back then. They still do it today. But yeah, people just find any sort of excuse because they don't want to blame themselves, all right? You're either a bow spammer, you're a hacker, or uh, their dad was talking to them. But as you guys can see back then, the game was so much more simple and it was so much more fun. Another thing you may notice as well, there's no kits whatsoever. The game just wasn't pay to win whatsoever. All right, one year later, does my strategy from day one work 365 days later? Gotta obviously take out our neighbors first, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, we can't be getting rushed for the next 20 minutes. But when the game was still new, people used to just jump underneath you and try and knock you down for whatever reason. And you could just jump down and knock them off into the void. There's one kill. Watch this. And he's been outplayed. <laughs> but yeah, now the players have evolved. I want that season zero limited time mode. Oh yeah, look at that. My man's a Yuzi kit. But yeah, I was able to get a crossbow so much quicker back then because the armory did not exist. All right, let me get my armory and it's game over. I am now tanking from day one, bro. You can't forget where you came from, all right? All right, I've got to get my diamond armor next. You know what I'm saying? Hey, yo, cross the bridge, my boy. Cross the bridge. <laughs> He's going to die. What is he doing? Bro, what is he doing? Like, what? what is that even going to do? Diamond armor, diamond sword, and pearls. Void didn't exist back then, but we have no choice. Just look at the kits back then. This this game literally just turned into kit simulator. Holy. I remember this mode. It was 16 versus 16, and I actually did, like, the 1 versus 16. I don't even know if balloons even existed, to be honest. I can't remember. So there wasn't any balloons, and I was using the archer kit. Okay, that makes sense. This is my most popular Bedwars video. Who would have thought that me making a video about a bed defense would end up being my most popular one? Like, what? But yeah, I actually want to go see if this works nowadays. I don't think this will. Bro, look at him. He's just, like, mad confused. Like, look. <laughs> my man hollowed out the entire bed defense and still tried. All right, we're going to need a lot of stone. Bro, this is going to take me forever, man. Why does it have to be a map that actually takes a lot of blood? Bro, he's probably just watching me do this right now. It's okay. No! No! I was too busy building and I did not see him coming out of nowhere, bro. I mean, it was a bad map anyways. It was going to take me 10 years. Bro, you cannot have fun in this game anymore. It just doesn't exist, does it? You just can't do anything. Why would you run back to me? Why? Runner and Algear are so bad. Why are you Algear? Bro, what did I say about the excuses, guys? Bro, I had sat to lobby out of so many matches. It just kept giving me grass. I don't know what the game's trying to tell me, bro, but I got nothing but grass map. I'll let you get your iron, you crazy. You are not escaping, you crazy. Oh, there we go. We can get the generator. <gasps> yeah, this is not obvious at all. I don't know what anyone's talking about. Watch me just waste my time right here. Like, I do this and then nobody comes, bro. There we go. Now we just pretend this is now the new bed. So what I'm going to do to try and make it even more, like, believable is try and, like, bridge across over here to mid. I'm going to do from here to the diamond gen. Watch it end up being, like, the biggest sweat in the entire game and I'm just wasting my time. According to my calculations, this bed defense is four blocks higher than usual. That doesn't look too bad at all. Anyone with half a brain will know it's fake. But we'll see. We'll see if he falls for it anyways. So how much more stacked do you want to be? Bro, what is you doing, bro? Just get the bed. What is he doing, man? Hey! Get out of my gen. What is going? He just suffocated. Why is he putting spirits on my bed? I don't get it. No! Everyone in this game literally thinks this is hardcore, man. They die once and then they just leave. At this point, I'm just going to play any map it gives me, to be honest, bro. I am not lobbying for another 80 matches. It's so boring. Even if it's a map with grass, sand, sandstone, swamp, I don't care. All right, take out my neighbor first, though. You know what I'm saying? Stone around this one like this, okay? And then I'm actually going to build my bed defense on his base to see if people fall for it that way. Okay, I need to bridge over to the diamonds over here. Bridge over to mid from here. I think the bigger this looks, the more believable it'll be. I've got to get rid of those bridges over there, man. I've got to use these bridges instead. What if they see the bed defense and they think it's too thick so that they don't even want to try, you know? Ah, come on, bro. You want to come break my bed? Bro, what do I have to do to make them actually go try? Does he just not want to win faster? I don't get it. I'll just kill him once. And oh, there we go. We got him once. All right. Is he following me? Oh, oh my gosh. Why is he going mid? I really do not understand how people can play the game like this. Just go break my bed. I literally get unlucky every time I want to do something fun. It's like fun doesn't even exist anymore. Yeah, bro, I couldn't make it any more obvious. 
What are you doing, man? Just stop. <laughs> He's still mining in, bro. He's still trying to find it. He's like, what? I mean, at least it worked, bro. At least it worked. He's still mining. <laughs> He went inside. He's literally inside the bed defense. Has he even re- <laughs> He's still trying. He's still trying, bro. Oh my god, he boss she is. He's literally about to shear away every single block. My man must be so confused, bro. Let's go see the damages. <laughs> he literally hollowed out the entire thing. Oh, that was fun, bro. That was worth it, alright? That was worth it, I think. Kind of. Kind of worth it. Bro, four hits with a wooden pickaxe and that thing was gone, dude. But yeah, this is when JK first came out and uh, JK's a little bit different now, but after my one versus 30 clutch of Jade, everybody was using Jade after that. Yeah, JK back then was pretty much my favorite kit in the game and it was for a while and I haven't used it ever since it got nerfed. Jade Avoid was like overused because of how good the movement is. Everybody's using Yuzi because of the movement. I have no idea how far you can go with this hammer, to be honest. I do not remember. Okay, it's not too bad. I'm pretty sure some people told me that you can actually knock people up in the sky and they'll take fall damage now. Oh, they do. Okay. Bang. Kind of OP, actually. What the heck? Bing, you dead. Oh. <gasps> yeah. Man's really jaded 2022. Lol. What? Bro, he's saying that as he dies to jade. Like, what? Bing. Yo, what up? Bink! Bink! This is the last ability right here. Bink! <laughs> oh, how's that full damage? How's that full damage, huh? Oh, she wasted it. Bink! <laughs> wait, what? Oh, wait, what? How come some people go flying in the sky and some people... Why? Just what? Oh! Auntie Cheat saved her even though she went... Auntie Cheat just saved her even though she didn't even try. Who remembers this? <laughs> Hey, yo, I'm sure a lot of you guys remember this, bro. 88 emeralds, and I'm just under the map flaming people from like a mile away. All right, and then one year later, we're into season five. But yeah, I can't go through every single video and remember everything that changed about the game because uh, I don't even remember last night. But yeah, skip forward to a year, bro. We have enchantments, we have season five, we have about a million kits and about a million sweats. But yeah, I guess we'll see if I can make this video in another year's time, whether I'm still playing the game or not, because it's all downhill from here. Hackers and sweats are definitely going to ruin this game. I'm calling it. I'm just bored of the game in general, to be honest. I, I have no idea why, to be honest. I just had way more fun back then than I do now. But yeah, the game's changed quite a lot over the year. And I'd like to know when you guys first started playing Bed Wars and when your favorite time was playing Bed Wars. But yeah, it's been like up and down. There's been times where I really enjoy the game and times where I don't really enjoy the game. I mean, look at this right here. Four months ago, I was even going to quit Bed Wars. And if you ever bored one day, go ahead and feel free to check all of my older videos. It's like a year's worth of Bed Wars, all right?